This weekend, I want to share one word with you that can give you real power when you need that power. I shared this a few years ago in talking with ministers, and uh, some have reported they still use it even today, to remind themselves to go up a bit higher than they would have done, even when they're tired and fatigued. And you can do the same. The word is sparkle, and I'm going to talk about that right now. Samuel Goldwyn once said this, No person who is enthusiastic about their work has anything to fear from life. Well, we all know people that have great potential, but they're not enthusiastic. They just do not have that sparkle in them. And it's the one thing, the one key ingredient that they're missing to a successful life. Don't you be like that. Make sure that you have sparkle in you. Now, let me tell you a story. Born in 1928, Shirley Temple became the biggest box office draw in the United States by the tender age of just 10. Amazingly, millions of Americans still love to watch her childhood performances. What is the attraction for movies that were made so very long ago? In many ways, the films seem as fresh today as they did back then, in part because of the advice that the young actress received from her mother. Shirley's mother had a strange strategy, but it worked. She would whisper one word in the ear of Shirley Temple before the director uh, said action and the film started to roll. That one word that Shirley's mom whispered in her daughter's ear was sparkle. It was little Shirley's reminder to concentrate and to give her performance her full attention, her all, her enthusiasm. All of us can benefit from a one-word cue that helped Shirley Temple and has helped many other people over the past decades. It helped make Shirley Temple a star, and it will make you a star in whatever you're doing, at work, at home. So today, whether you're at work or at home, school or play, Bring enthusiasm into it. The one word that I say to you is sparkle. And you know what? Your audience will love you for it. One of my favorite Bible quotes. Romans 15, 13. May the God of hope fill you with all joy. Now that's a complete infilling from the top of your head to the bottom of your feet. And peace as you trust in God so that you may overflow. Now that's the enthusiasm coming forth from you. Overflowing with hope by the power of the Holy Spirit, which is the whole Spirit of God. Sparkle, my friend.